Okay, so these are the mini Trident tools, the smaller mini version of our original Trident Tumblr tool. And today we're gonna to go over a video on how to use this tool to sublimate your tumblers. Okay, so for the mini Trident Pinch Perfect, it is gonna come with four separate things. One of those being the sizing card right here. This will tell you how to adjust the tool, which slot to use for the specific tumbler size you are trying to wrap. You'll obviously get the main body of the tool, the tumbler support pin, and the tumbler adjusting strap. So to put the tool together, very simple. There's a slot right here. The end of the strap goes through it, and then it'll come out the back over here. And then just take your tumbler support pin and place it in. So to adjust this tool to the specific tumbler size you want to wrap, this card right here will tell you top slot and bottom slot. And the top slot is referring to this pin slot right here, and the bottom slot is referring to this pin slot right here. It's also going to tell you the strap numbers, which are located on the back of the strap right here. There's numbers one through 12 on the back here. So you want to correlate that strap number to the tumbler size you are trying to wrap. And if your tumbler size isn't on this card, go ahead and measure the diameter of the tumbler you're trying to wrap and compare it to some of the diameters on here and that will give you a good reference to start with. So for example, we have a 20 ounce skinny tumbler here. The 20 ounce skinny right here, it's gonna be on the top slot on a strap number of seven. So let's get that set up. So the first thing we wanna do is find the seven on the back of this strap right here. So the seven is right here. Now what we wanna do, is go ahead and take your thumb and place it right on the seven and then find your tumbler support pin. And like it said on the sizing card right here, top slot, we're gonna put it on the top slot, push it all the way down until it's all the way in. Now to make sure it's locked in, this tumbler support does need pressure. So when you place your tumbler on it, it will stay locked in. But just to check, put your thumb on it, pull. If nothing moves, then you're good to go. Step one before pre-wrapping your tumbler is to make sure that the lock is up and then back like this. It's a little different than our regular trident that you can easily pull up and down here. So once the lock is up and out of the way, what we're going to do is take your tumbler, pre-wrap your tumbler, and by that I just mean placing it on the table, making sure it's tight around the back. We're gonna make sure that the pin is all the way down, so apply some pressure, make sure it's not moving, it's stuck there. Take your tumbler, place it centered in the middle, push down, and then twist your tumbler to make sure that the seam line is facing directly up. If you can see that directly up, you're gonna take the strap handle, pull over, give it a little squeeze, and then we're going to take the lock here, push it over to the other side, onto the metal bar across. It'll stay like that and now your tumbler is locked in so you can tape hands-free, keeping your wrap tight. Okay, so we have our tape here. Now what I like to do and what I always suggest doing is when you're taping with the tool, I always suggest starting your first two pieces of tape, one on one side and one on the other side of both these handles. So let's do that. We're gonna take our tape, place it there, pull over, apply some pressure to the seam line. Same thing on the other side, here, over, pressure to the seam line. Now that you have those two pieces of tape done, you can go ahead and just tape across the rest of the tumbler. You'll usually be able to get six to eight pieces of tape while your tumbler is in the tool, depending on the size of the tumbler. So once you're done taping with the tool, what you wanna do is squeeze just slightly on both the handles so that the pin pops up, pull it back, let go of the handle, and then you can take your tumbler out finish taping or put it in the heat press, whatever you want to do. Okay, so I have my two tumblers right here. I have a 16 ounce Libby glass and a 40 ounce handle tumbler. So let's start with the 40 ounce handle tumbler. What we're gonna do is, like I said with the card, 40 ounce is gonna be all the way down here at the bottom. So we have 40 ounce handle right here. So that's gonna be in the bottom slot on a strap number of two. So that is right on the end of the strap. So a two is gonna be all the way back here. Put your thumb on the two, push it all the way back till your thumb is hitting the back of the tool. Make sure it's the first number showing. Now I said bottom slot, so we're gonna place the pin down at the bottom. Everything is in place. The support is all the way down. We're gonna take the lock out, back up. And we're gonna take our 40 ounce handle tumbler. We're gonna place it in, pull over on the strap. We're gonna give it a little squeeze, push up on the locking key, over onto the metal bar across and it'll lock and then you're good to go. Like I mentioned, 
to release the tumbler, give it a little squeeze again, pull the lock back, and then you're good to go. Okay, so now we have a 16 ounce Libby glass. Now 16 ounce Libby glass is on the back of here. It's gonna be on the bottom slot and it's gonna be on a strap number of seven. You're gonna find seven on the strap, put your thumb on it, take the pin out, move your thumb to the back of the tool with the number, place your pin in, make sure it's all the way down, lock his back, place your tumbler centered in, pull over on the strap, give it a little squeeze, lock across onto the bar and you're good to go. Squeeze to release, pull, pull the lock back, and then you're all good. So that is how you use the mini Trident Pinch Perfect. If you have any questions, head over to our website. And if you're on our website, bottom right corner, there's a message box and there's also a contact page on there. If not, enjoy this tool, hope it helps, and thanks for watching this video.